What is up everyone, Northside here, and you, as you can see, developer blog post, Rot Valley Battle Pass. We got some information, as you can see, one of the rewards here, and we got, with the return of the Rot Valley to Neverwinter, this, there will be also a new Battle Pass. Dark Rumblings are afoot once again in Neverwinter, and Lord Neverwinter has opened the Protector's Enclave Vault to worthy adventurers who will bring glory to Neverwinter. So we got the dates here, Rot Valley Battle Pass begins Tuesday, August 9, and Rot Valley ends on november 22nd as you can see here on tuesday also see details for each milestone start date now note that milestones no longer begin at the first of the month starting august 9 2022 adventurers of neverwinter will be able to progress to the rot valley battle pass by completing random queues and by completing major heroic encounters in rot valley each day you complete the following task to progress random trial or random skirmish queue random dungeon or random advanced que dungeon queue and major heroic encounters in Rot Valley. As with the previous battle pass progress and reward claims are account wide. Milestone starts on August 9th and run for 5 weeks each. The final milestone ends on November 22nd, like I said. You can purchase a premium battle pass for 2.5000 Zen and unlock premium track for all 3 milestones. If you have a premium battle pass, you can still complete milestones after they are over. The premium battle pass is available for, to purchase through November 22nd. There are milestone buyouts that start at 1000 Zen per milestone. The cost is reduced by how much progress you've already made in, it, in that milestone. Progress for premium pass, holder, pass holders can be done through November 22 and premium pass and milestone buy, buy, buyouts are account wide purchases. Rewards finally. Milestone 1 takes stock of life. Players who complete milestone, there's a typo here, a brand new mini van panda vanity pet. The new dragonfire gadget, which can be activated from the potion tray, has, has a miniature mechanical dragon breath on fire on your foes, a coalescent mode. Pl players will also earn shards of greater empowerment, reward reroll tokens, enchanted keys, and astral log walks. Milestone 2, up the upper crust. Players who fight their way through the challenges of milestone 2 will be granted the following items. An account-wide artifact choice pack, including the following options, Neverwinter Standard, Jewel of the North, Repurposed Phylactery, Dragonbone Wand, or if you have all the artifacts, 200 Tartarmalon tra trade bars to help you to your journey, a brand new Panda Augment Companion, unlock for your account. Players will also gain Scrolls of Life, Scrolls of Mass Life, Companion Library Tokens, a Greater Stone of he Health, Enchanted Keys, and an Astral Log Box. Milestone 3, Deeper Wounds. For the adventurers persistent enough to complete the third milestone, the following items will be granted. A coalescent mode, the new account White Glorious Panda mount, as you can see here. And adventurers will also acquire shards of greater empowerment, enchanted keys, mount library tokens, and an astral log box. Misa Gantz, lead product manager. So this is it. This is uh, uh, just a sneak peek. It, it begins in five days, I think, four or five days. And uh, just quick info from the developer blog post posted by actually Nito Chris. So thank you for watching. Shout out to my channel members. And Northside is out.